everyone. I have got a new confetti collection box. It was left out on the rain on one of my neighbors who was out of town doorstep for a few days and they delivered it to me this morning. So anyway, if you are interested to see what comes in a nice wet confetti collection box, just hang around with me and we will check it out together. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping in and joining me for a little bit today. To my subscribers, thank you, thank you so much. It really means the world to me to have your support. I would be totally lost without you, so thank you, thank you, thank you. If you are new to my channel, and um, I know I've got some new subscribers this week again, so thank you so much for joining me. If you are new to my channel and you haven't subscribed, I hope that you click on that red subscribe button over there. I hope you come back to visit, and I hope everyone gives this video a thumbs up. Your comments, of course, are always, always welcome. And today I have got a new box to me. It is Confetti Collections. And I watched Bopper from BC Sales open up a few of these boxes and they just really look cute. So there's like eight plus items that you get in there. The stationary items like notepads and to-do list and sticky notes or any kind of novelty type gift item, something you can give away or use for yourself. They all come with a gift bag, some bows and some ribbon, and of course the confetti that's in the box that you can use to help stuff that gift bag and make it look pretty. So the box is, was voted uh, best box under $25, so that's pretty cool. It comes out every other month. It's $19.99, and I think it's $5 for shipping. It ships out of Pennsylvania, and it's a flat $5 fee that comes by FedEx. So anyway, I thought we would get into this. And this actually, I don't remember what day it rained last week, but um, it was delivered a few doors down to a neighbor that was out of town. He came back today, so it was out in the rain and out for a few days. So it's um, it's a little messy, but as um, I remember Barbara from opening up her box, I knew it was covered with plastic, so I just waited for it to finish drying the rest of the way. So let's get into this and see what we got. And of course, better late than ever, right? I probably should have checked on it sooner and I might have just walked down the street myself and got it. But anyway, this is the inside of the box. And it is, it is it's covered with some nice bubble wrap. We've got all kinds of confetti here. So I know it's safe. The box does not look that pretty, but it's what's inside the box that counts, right? Alrighty, so we've got this beautiful pink bag right here. And since I... I wasn't sure if I would be able to get the same box Barbara get. Um, so it might be a little bit different or it might be exactly the same. So we can figure it out. But this first one is that metal cup that she opened. So it's really, really pretty. It should be a nice coffee cup and the metal will help keep it hotter a little bit longer. It's got uh, some nice floral detail, little metal ring. So that's very cute. And this is my bundle. Got a beautiful sticker, Confetti Collections. And the box. So it says surprise. This is really stuck pretty good. Uh, surprise, note to self box. Are you excited? Because we are. We put together a box full of cute and clever surprises just for you. Note to self, get creative. And it says, post your pics using the hashtag confetti collection box. So I will try to do that. Alrighty, so this is the rest of it. Alrighty, so let's get this bad boy opened up and see what we've got. And again, I wasn't really worried because, you know, the box didn't look pretty. It had been out in the rain, but I knew everything was protected in plastic. So first thing, we have this list. It's got a little type closure right there with the flower detail. 
and then just a pad of paper with the bullet points so you can make list which comes in handy when I'm thinking about what do I have to do especially for work it's like okay what are my priorities for the day I've got uh, machines in port that I haven't let anybody know about gotta, gotta write that down gotta let people know okay so this machine's coming in but do I have my rigor set when is the machine going to be delivered so list come in handy and again we got the cute little tiny bows these are all nice pretty pink some pink ribbon and a little gift bag with a heart and flowers and it's pink on the bottom so it'll go pretty with this and a pink ribbon and the pink tissue paper that you can use to help uh, fill it out and we got another super cute list pad in the shape of a butterfly and it is different colors I probably should have taken my knife over here that I used earlier today and this is why part of the reason I don't have fingernails too in case you've under wondered why my nails are so short no this is part of the reason so I don't know if it's post-it doesn't look like a regular post-it paper but um, it's just a notepad that's attached to the side and there's different colors in here like yellows and greens and some blues and reds and pinks so really pretty for putting notes on paper so I go through a lot of post-its at work when I send things out I usually end up retaping it or stapling it so people can't say oh your post-it note fell off Nancy sorry we didn't see it yeah I'll tape it and staple it and send it and then some cute little butterfly paper here and I think this will be cute in my motivation motivational type journal to kind of put that down and maybe jot a few words on it or some words right under it I think that'll look cute and we got two more things in here so here's the uh, floral napkins to go with the cup so that's pretty nice and the last item in here it's called color me it's a color me color me coloring notepad so on the inside you've got your lined paper and then some place where you can doodle and color and I've got a not a ton but I've got quite a few um, of the adult coloring books and a couple of different sets of pencils I used to always uh, have it in my hospital bag so I've still got my hospital bag is still downstairs I, I never emptied it uh, but anyway I've got tons of colored pencils and I really should get into the coloring again so anyway I might bring up some colored pencils and as I do my shopping list and figure out what diet foods what crappy diet foods I can get for the week what do I want to make for the week and then just uh, kind of doodle because you can only write salad so many ways to make it look exciting so the colors will help make that look good so anyway this was my box for this month and it's uh, the June July box um, and again you can you can order online I'll leave the website below it comes every two months for $19.99 and a $5 flat shipping fee I think that you can prepay to maybe get a year in advance and it will be a little bit cheaper than that but I will leave that in my description so thank you everyone for joining me and if you get this um, box let me know how you like it if uh, what other items that you've got that are just really useful or what do you think I can look forward to in my next few boxes so thanks everyone I hope you go out and have a fantastic week this week and we will all chat again soon thanks bye bye